This is Sports News Africa Express. Here is a quick run through of some of the headlines in African sports with me, Angela Agor. Coach Ephraim Mashaba looks set to replace Darren Keat with Jackson Mabel Kwani in the, and Kaiser Chiefs towering central defender Molomu Wandu Mathoho comes in for teenager Rivaldo Coetzee when South Africa take on Senegal. South Africa need a result against Senegal to stay alive in the competition. Ivory Coast will be without Jovino, who is serving a two-match ban following a clash with Guinea's Nabi Keita. The Elephants have a perfect record against Mali in the tournament, winning all three previous encounters, including the, the semi-finals in 2012 in the tournament. And the Ivorians will be hoping to make it four out of four when they meet in Malabo on Saturday. Cameroon will have Stephen, Mb Stephen Mbaya back for the game against Guinea on Saturday after he served a one-game suspension against Mali last Tuesday. Both Guinea and Cameroon come into this match with a point each following their one-all draws against the Ivory Coast and Mali respectively. And Guinea, who managed to hold one of the tournament's favourites, Ivory Coast, to a draw, will hope to go one better when they play Cameroon. Tunisia have jumped to the top of Group B after snatching a late win against Zambia. The Carthage Eagles are two points clear of Cape Verde after their smash-and-grab victory in Evivian. Captain Yassin Chigahawi nodded the winning goal in the 88th to make it 2-1. And International Table Tennis Federation's Africa Senior Championships have begun in the Egyptian capital, Cairo. Egypt and Nigeria are expected to do well in these championships. On Thursday, Sports News Africa spoke to Nigeria's Aruna Quadri, the 2014 World Player of the Year, who said he was looking forward to the competition. And that's your Sports News Africa Express for today. For more on these stories, you can follow us on, on Twitter or subscribe to our YouTube channel. Bye for now.